looking over here. Look, there are five or six hyenas swimming around an expired hippopotamus. A little bit gory. If you are a slightly sensitive viewer, I do apologize. But as the rain starts to fall here in the Masai Mara, these hyenas have started to feast upon the rotting carcass of this hippopotamus. And, um, well, it really is quite remarkable because the skin of a hippopotamus is so deeply, deeply thick that they would probably hyenas. They would probably have had to wait for it to get a little bit rancid before they were able to open it up. And you can see that they've just managed to open it up and they've pulled out a little bit of the belly. Now, I think Jamie was here. I don't know if she was live uh, when she saw this this morning, but apparently this... <laughs> <laughs> these hyenas popped open the stomach and of course they don't seem to have you know, the same issue with stink that we do and uh, unfortunately uh, some of the guests that were around here had to jump in their car and drive away very quickly because the smell was apparently quite profound anyway we're having a wonderful sighting the smell is not bad at all and So I do apologize for our absence from this drive, at least we're making some kind of contribution at the moment, but that's good fun at the moment, we're enjoying our hippopotamus. <laughs> Isn't that remarkable? And all I can, I mean, I don't know if you can hear it, but I can hear the crunch, crunch, crunch of the skin being sort of taken to pieces. And there is a little bit of smell of rotting going on. But the hyenas are now well and truly into this, and I suppose the water will probably hasten the rotting process. Hello, Wallow. You say that you feel like you can smell it from here. Well, I don't know. I'm not surprised in the slightest. Uh, it, it's actually not that bad. I think it's because of the rain and the wind. I think it would be a lot worse had it been a beatingly hot sort of typical day that we get here. But at the moment, it's really quite pleasant. Uh, well, uh, pleasant is a strong term for what it is, but it is quite interesting. In fact, let's just, um, can I ask you, Manuel, to just go on to the head of the hippo? Can you see it? <laughs> oh, hang on. One of them got a little one got a little bit cheeky. It's quite interesting. Oh, very nice to see. Oh, says one of them. Sounds are just one of the best things about them. Two little ones now, either looking for comfort or looking to bully a slightly less dominant one herself or himself. Remember, that's how even human beings who get thumped, especially as kids, if a small child gets thumped, he'll often take his frustrations out on an even smaller child. This is just a wonderful, wonderful sighting. Anyway, what I wanted to say about the head was I don't, I didn't think that the head was actually too badly eaten. At least I think it was quite badly eaten. There are a whole lot more hyenas coming in now. One, two, three, just off to the right there. Yeah, a couple more coming in now. See what all the ruckus is about. Who's fighting with whom? Two youngsters have been scolded and they're moving oh. off. This is brilliant stuff. Manners, are you recording? I am not. Great. Now there's a bit of a stink. I, it smells like sort of rancid wet dog at the moment. Which of course hyenas are not, but they are fairly rancid at this stage of the game. And they are wet and they are furry. getting some communications from the vehicle next door. He says it's fine, he can see what's going on. Ah, very pleased that we finally got some wonderful signal. Now, aka PT Watcher. This is just amazing. 
Every time I want to say something about them, they start to fight. PT Watcher, you say, did the hyena kill the hippo? Uh, no, the hyena did not kill the hippo. I don't think. Um, I think it would... I'm not sure if it died of natural causes. I'm actually not really sure at all. How it died. I believe we're still having one or two audio issues. I'm sorry about that. And we might try and turn up my microphone. You turn up my mic. How's that? Is that a bit better? There we go. That's probably a bit better. Now, how many have we got here? We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We've had another two. And just behind us, I can see three more. Just fantastic. Now the smell is coming. As the wind changes and comes towards us, I can smell the cold guts. Now, if you are a new viewer, first of all, I apologize for the goriness of the scene, but that's just what happens out here. Second of all, what Man Manuel is filming now, of course, is a young hyena, and the, hy the hierarchy of these clans. Oh, there goes the digestive tract. Very nice. <laughs> <laughs> now there's oh now there's a smell well okay let's we're gonna probably move on from here we've got to head back up the hill so let's head across to brent leo smith he's got some lions and some cubs <laughs> 